Welcome to Nana's review. I hope you guys are having a magical day somehow because I am not. Um, today, Blue Ribbon Corn Dog is open at Boardwalk Walk Resort. Well, we thought they're not gonna open forever, but they finally opened it. And I'm the lucky one who get to try everything except cotton candy because their cotton candy machine is not working. So here is the five different kind of corn dog and the four lemonade. I don't know which lemonade is which flavor. So we will figure out together. Uh, fair warning, I don't like cilantro and I do not like pickle and peanut butter. So that is like half of the corn dog. I already, I'm not already liking it. So we'll see what can we do about it and let's dig them into it. Let's start off with the classic. Why not, right? So the classic one, this is a classic corn dog and this is a kid's classic corn dog. Well, the lady was like, well, kids cannot eat the whole thing. So the kids get the shorter one. You know, I was the Miss Corn Dog when I was in high school because I was eating a corn dog for breakfast every time I go to the school. So, you know, they kept calling me Miss Corn Dog. And here, Miss Corn Dog eating different kind of corn dog in Disney World. How fantastic and magical it is, right? I know, I know. Also, I am really sweaty and I'm hot, so I'm a little bit spicy as in the usual. Well, I'm usually spicy, so it's all right. But anyways, I'm going to start with the classic. Classic, classic. And I know you guys want to see the inside, so... Ugh. Here is the inside. Honey, what do you expect? It's just a layer of corn dog, right? It's corn dog. What do you want me to say? <laughs> I like those... It. I like the edge, so. Hey kids, let's eat the kids' corn dog. Yeehaw. You know what? I read the other comment that I make in this review. It's not gonna be sounds right, but I will do it either way. Um, what it called? What is it? What What is the thing called? Breading around? Breading? Like breading is really thin. I like the bread part. The sausage is. 90% sausage, 10% breading. So, you know, a lot of people complain about like too much breading, but this is opposite. It's thin breading. I'm complaining about the thin breading. I like the bread part. I mean, I guess it's well made, but I like the Disneyland corn dog, to be honest. The Disneyland corn dog, and maybe this one? It's hard to say, but I'm sure it's better than Universal's corn dog. Next one. Um, Golden Dragon. OB hot dog. Fried in corn, cornmeal butter. Rolled in panko bread crumbs. Served with sriracha, mayo, and sweet Thai chili. And bag of chips. I think they tried to market thing to the asian people because they put the panko and everything and with the sriracha mayo of course well it's it's heavy <laughs> it is like five pounds what do you want me to do well well like i said people want to see what is inside so let's break it all right here we go okay this is too much sausage party already and i'm not having it and also, it's like 100 degree outside, and I'm sweating and eating. Thanks, Tom. Thank you, Tom. I'll never forget about day. Let's try. So the best way to describe what it is, is if you go to any sushi place, and if you ask for dragon roll, you know the little breading around the sushi? This is what it is. They use the same thing. This, Like I said, panko breadcrumbs fry them <laughs> it's really thick like you can see it and it literally tastes like some Asian sushi dragon roll and this sriracha mayonnaise is really spicy and I know it's not Japanese mayo like I make in the house And I feel like it's not fully cooked. Well, if I if I don't well today, Tom, 
We need the workers compensation for that. Thai chili spice, sweet Thai chili. Wow. It's yeah, it's a Thai chili spice flavor. I don't know how can I describe Thai chili flavor? Yeah, it is spicy and sour. That's the best way we can say. But yeah. If I'm hungry and if it's not like 100 degree outside, I would love it. But it's just too hot and I don't want to eat any fried food right now. <laughs> not a crime. You know what? I'm going to try one of the lemonade. I mean, two of the lemonade. So we do have full lemonade, but um, it's all good mixed. I don't know which one is which one. It's supposedly lemon. I think this is lemon for sure. And then one of them is the lemon and strawberry. I don't know. I think maybe this one or this one. I don't know. And then the other two should be hibiscus and a raspberry. All right. I'm going to take two out of this. Let's see. This sort of red one. I mean, it's melting. It's been sitting here for a while now. So. I taste this somewhere before. I assume this is raspberry. I had same taste candy before somewhere. I don't remember, but it tastes like raspberry candy. What it called? Not the nerf. 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 Nerds. It tastes like nerds. Say like this raspberry. And if it's not, correct me. All right. The second one, it's little color-wise, it looked like a peach, but I know it's not going to be a peach because we don't have peach. Maybe hibiscus? It's sour. Some sort of sour. So I think it's got to be this hibiscus. <laughs> Oh, it's it's sour. I I don't like sour stuff, so here we are. Right? Hibiscus, raspberry, strawberry, like a lemonade. And see this one. Oh, definitely strawberry. I don't like strawberry, but I can taste strawberry. Ugh. strawberry what do you expect it's strawberry lemonade oh i'm already having a heartburn you know what lemonade i will leave it for now okay let's go back to the food the two things i don't like the most in this world let's start off as mexican street dog jalapeno cheddar sauce fried in corn meal butter Top with the garlic mayo, corn dog, no, corn kennel, cottage, cottage, cottage cheese. I'm taking a Spanish on Duolingo, but it's only like maybe four, six months, so not that great. And cilantro garnished with the lime wedge and served with the bag of chips. I know we have so many bag of chips. I don't need it, but we have it. Um, like I said, I hate cilantro. I know hate is a really strong word, but I do not like cilantro. I cannot fix it. I don't like it. I don't like cilantro. There is no way that I will eat it. So I'm going to clean off some of the cilantro. So I'm not going to cry. Didn't do well. Sorry, y'all. Here's the inside. And the cilantro flying off. So far. This is the best one that you can eat. <laughs> okay, so the reason why this is the best because these two just straight to oil. Like you can just taste the oil. Like you can just feel it's so deeply fried. But this one, I don't know why, but the sauce and corn and cheese make it everything flat. And make me feel like this is the best corn. Uh, it's, this is the best corn dog that you can eat. I don't know why it's weird. I don't like cilantro, but I'm enjoying this thing. What in the world? But 
I like this one. I'm I'm sure I'm gonna take off all the cilantro and dig more, but it's spicy. So don't forget it's spicy. These sauce are spicier, but this one's still spicy. Just letting you know. Be aware. <sighs> Lemonade. So the lemonade is supposedly fresh, no, squeeze, fresh, fresh, squeezed lemonade. So it's fresh, I can tell. It tastes like a carnival lemonade. That is the best way to describe it. All right, well, I think I need to say player before I'm gonna eat this because I do not like pickle and I do not like, um, <laughs> I do not like peanut butter and I do not like pickle and I do not like peanut butter. This is the most American thing that I can ever have in my life. I'm living in the States for like 16, 17 years now. I'm, I'm born and raised in Tokyo, so I'm not from here. Well, you can tell by my accent, but like pickle and peanut butter are the most American thing that I can think. Not the burger. A lot of people say they, that, that they will say burgers and hot dog, but I think peanut butter and the pickle are the most American thing. Anyways, well, they come with it. They come with knife and fork. I'm sure they thought I will use that. <laughs> Man, who thought about this? Seriously? They have a hot dog inside pickle. Why they did that? First of all, whose idea to shove a sausage inside a pickle and then fried it? I don't know why they did it. It's, it's, it's weird flavor, but I also forgot to dip in this peanut butter sauce. Oh my gosh, I'm wiping the same paper. I'm wiping my hands, face, everything with the one paper. I don't care at this point. <sighs> Let me get the sausage part off of it and then dip in awesome peanut butter sauce. And we go from there. Okay, how about that? And also, this fork is not doing any justice. Okay. Hey, this is the way, right? I'm doing it. I'm doing it for the for the for the company's sake. Corn dog, pickle, and peanut butter sauce. Okay. Well, it took me a second to eat this awesome pickled corn dog um <laughs> my opinion on this corn dog if you put if you dip in this peanut butter sauce it's good it's weird but it's good somehow it tastes okay but not my thing i'm sure if you like pickle you should just try it yeah the, pe <laughs> the peanut butter sauce make Pickle tastes more vegetable. I know it's vegetable, but it tastes more like the sourness is disappear. So it's not like layer pickle that you will taste in this corn dog if you dip in the peanut butter because the peanut butter sweetness will kill the sourness. So yeah, well, but not my thing to be fair. I had to drink my Coke, so I couldn't do just, you know, I couldn't just drink the lemonade and no, I couldn't deal with it. All right, anyways. um, So, oh, I had a fantastic five corn dogs, including the kids one. Kids classic corn dog. My favorite is street corn corn dog. Street corn corn dog or street corn corn dog. Well, there's so many corns, but, you know, that's what it is. This is the best one that I can say from here. And um, the worst one is maybe this one. The dragon corn dog. I think that's, that was the name, I think. Well, if I'm wrong, please correct me. But um, 
But if you like pickle, maybe try this. I mean, maybe it's good for TikTok or social media, any Instagram, whatever. But um, yeah. Well, I think I survived another uh, corn dog review, aka food review. I don't like food reviews. You might know, you might already know, I don't like food reviews because I don't have much vocabulary that I can describe. Maybe I can do it in Japanese. Maybe no. Maybe no. Who knows? But anyways, I am flying out to California tomorrow to do the Oogie Boogie Bash, and I'm gonna eat another corn dog there. I know. Well, hopefully, I will make some sort of social content out of it. If not, you might not gonna see it. Um, but please subscribe and like this awesome review if you like it. If you don't like it, let me know. You can my DM is wide open, or you can just message Tom. Nana did suck. Anyways, have a magical day.